Out of the sentencing of Saifullo Saipov, who just learned he will spend the rest of his life in prison for carrying out that deadly terror attack along a Manhattan bike path back in 2017. Richard Giacovis is live outside Manhattan Federal Court with how the families of the victims are reacting to this sentencing. Richard? Natasha Steve, Saifullo Saipov was described by prosecutors as an unabashed terrorist and a proud murderer who deserved no leniency. Today, the Islamic extremist was sentenced to eight consecutive life sentences, more than 200 years in prison, after he was convicted of killing eight people in that Halloween terror-inspired attack back in 2017. Inside the courtroom today, Saipov had the chance to speak, and he did so for nearly an hour. There was no remorse from the defendant. Instead, he spent months much of the time praising the Quran and justifying jihad. Prosecutors wanted the death penalty for Saipov, saying he never showed any compassion for the people he killed, in that he may have been planning to kill more people that day. But the jury couldn't reach a unanimous decision when they deliberated back in March. When asked today if he did have any remorse or any regrets, Saipov sat motionless and wouldn't answer the question. It was Halloween six years ago when Saipov rented a Home Depot truck and mowed down pedestrians and bicyclists on a popular bike path that runs along the West Side Highway in Lower Manhattan. Saipov was shot by an NYPD officer moments after that crash when he came out of his truck yelling, God is great, in Arabic. Two Americans and six tourists were killed that day. Family and friends of those victims spoke outside federal court before the sentencing was handed down. We'll hear from them first and then one of the jurors who decided Saipov's fate. I decided to forgive, in fact. Um, but, you know, to forgive because... I didn't want to give opportunity to hatred, to rage. Because let's be fair, rage, hatred, what is it creating? Destruction. These are complete strangers. We all got to know each other, and we all bore the brunt of this responsibility in such a sober, compassionate fashion. It really reinvigorated my faith in the U.S. justice system. So the sentence today for Saipov, more than 200 years in prison, eight consecutive life sentences after he was convicted of killing eight people in that Halloween attack. Saipov's lawyers told, the, told jurors today that his actions were senseless, horrific, and there was no justification for them. We're live in federal court in Lower Manhattan, Richard Giacobas, Fox 5 News.